my guys I am going to try out the Lankis Extended DIY Salon Lash Extended Application That's what the box looks like It's the first time I'm going to try the DIY lashes from any product So let's hope this goes well um, I generally like using these smaller cluster lashes on top of my eyelid um, on top of the lashes and um, building my lashes with them instead of with uh, one bigger lash I feel like I've got better control and I can control the way I want longer lashes and where I want shorter lashes uh, and because I have the hooded eyes I try to keep the inner side of my eyelids a bit more open with short lashes or just put the lashes up to the middle part of my eyes and just to be able to get that little bit of color on the, the lid of my eye to come through so and I try to use longer lashes at the edges to give my eyes a bit of a lift so let's see what's in the package and we'll take it from there I bought these from Amazon and they had two options I can't remember what the other option was but I went with the fluffy style I wanted to get something to give the outer edges of my eyes a bit more flair and it comes with a, a brush spoolie brush like this and like a tweezer tool type of thing with the, the seal just a little rubber thingy that I battled with now um, a tweezer like that and at the end it has a little comb so you can brush through your lash lashes with the comb and then the lashes comes in two sizes uh, 12 millimeter and 14 millimeter so the idea is to put longer lashes on the outer side of the eye and then you get this two-in-one bond and glue applicator uh, you first put the bond then the lashes and then the glue is to give the second protective layer and I'm gonna see if I can get this to focus but that's what the lashes look like up close the fluffy lashes that you can see that it focuses so before I do anything I just want to use this spoolie and brush through my lashes and make sure that there's no knots or fuzz or anything stuck to the lashes why I'm brushing the bottom lashes so I'm not going to use it on them only the top lashes and then the instructions say that you need to apply the bond and then wait for 60 seconds for the glue to get tacky and then as an optional after 60 seconds you can come through the eyelashes with the brush to prevent the natural eyelashes from sticking Together. Then you place the clusters underneath um, one to two millimeter away from the waterline. Then you use your tool to just crimp your lashes together and you apply the glue. Sounds easy enough, sounds straightforward, so let's hope it's as easy as it sounds. It's a good thing that this application bottle actually says the bond on the bond side step one because I would be the person who loses the instructions and not remember which side goes on first.
So I guess I can brush with the spoolie. Seems. I can already start it. Drying up a bit. So I think what I'm going to do is take one of the smaller ones on the outermost part and then one of the longer ones and then maybe one or two of the smaller ones Let's see how it looks okay so it's been about 60 -ish seconds I hope uh, I am grabbing it at an angle like that and just going to try to look as up as I can and pop it onto the eyelash took very easily I'm trying to grip it on the outer half of the lash oh my lovely nope I'm just gonna try with my right hand Left hand is done, man. And I'm going in with one of the, the longer ones. Got that one right in the eye. a lot more natural than I expected. She's so pretty. Just pressing one of the smaller ones on the inner side. Okay, then I'm just going to softly try to just Press it a bit against my eyelashes. Actually, I think I should do the glue because I think the glue makes it be a little less tacky. But I'll do it again then. And then I'm brushing over them again with the Second brush, the glue one. Not sure if I'm supposed to put it on the top and the bottom, but from what I understand, this helps take that sticky, sticky effect away. And there we go, what do you think? I placed one of the smaller ones on the outer side and then two of the longer ones and then a short one a bit more to, closer to the inner corner and that's what the lashes look like now. What do you think? I like it. I think it looks not too fluffy, very natural. I wonder if you can layer them if you want a bit more volume. This does complement the look that I generally go for for everyday usage. So let me know if it's something that you might want to use or if it's not for you. 
They are supposed to last a few days as far as I understand. I'm not quite sure how exactly because you remove them with makeup remover and I'm obviously going to remove my makeup with makeup remover so I'll just put a comment in the description box to let you know if it lasted longer than my makeup look and for how long it did last and then I hope to see you guys next time. Bye!